Hey, what's up? Welcome to Monday Night's Meet Event. Today's going to be a little special. Um, so recently I was on uh, Shino's DJ stream. Uh, he called me out um, playfully. And I said, yeah, I'll come on stream. I'll play you. He wanted to, uh, he was doing some trophy grinding and he wanted to challenge me. So I said, yeah, no problem. So I played him and it turned into a best of three. So we're going to show all three games right here. All right, so right off the bat, he hits me with the Tariq Cohen coming out of the backfield. Um, I've only seen him play once. He played against Gorilla, and I can't even remember if Gorilla... I think Gorilla beat him uh, by, a, by a touchdown. So, but I don't know. I didn't really know his play style. He's a streamer, by the way, uh, if I didn't mention that. Uh, I will put his link in the, decision, uh, in the description also. All right, so... First, uh, first possession, he's going to hit Ridley over three guys. And I think on that play, I had um, Slay down, but he was in regular instead of prevent. So that was a big L. All right, so he's up 7 nothing. Um, I got Robinson. I got Ridley. No quarterback. Uh, I have seven energy I'm trying to drop uh, Adams, but it, it didn't happen. Uh, I hit, so I try to throw it to Ridley down the field. He knocks it down. All right, so now I got to start all over again. Um, I have uh, Adams available, uh, but I decided to run Ingram, who's now level eight. Uh, I played Gorilla also on this day, and I said, "Hey, you know what? I'm going to add Ingram back to the lineup. He's a uh, eight energy, and I don't even think he got ten yards. So that was a big L, also. But here he gets a big gainer, um, gets me uh, close to the touchdown area." Um, so what I do here is I drop Cook on the outside here, so he looks like, um, Ingram's gonna run, but I run Cook instead, and I think he got three yards on that. He had Aaron Donald, I didn't even see him on the field. Alright, so it's fourth down now, what do I do? He's got Aaron Donald down, I drop Stafford, I move Cook over, um, I drop somebody to, uh, block Donald, and, um, I get Adams out. So I throw it in the middle, hit Cook, touchdown. I was thinking about Adams, but uh, he had Humphrey on him. I, I didn't know how that was going to work. All right, so it's 12 seconds to go. Um, just trying to stop him. Go 7-7, seven, get, uh, get the 7-7 seven, seven at half. Uh, this will be the last play. I have Diggs. I have Marcus Peters. And I was trying to get a safety down, but I couldn't get him down. Um, he throws it down the field. There's a white contrail, and he makes the catch. Jamar Chase, that guy killed me in this game. Killed me. So he's up 14-7. Now, I'm not going to make excuses, but I was just coming off a three-game set with Gorilla, where uh, I think he beat me twice, I beat him once. So I was not having a good day. But, you know, uh, listen, new up-and-coming streamer wants to, uh, you know, wants to play me. I'm not going to say no. Uh, I won playing with Dalvin Cook here. I'm always trying to help out, um, you know, new and up-and-coming guys. So if you're a new and up-and-coming guy, get in touch with me, man. I'll try to, I'll help you out anytime, any any chance I get. All right, so it's 14-14. Uh, I, I have Dunlap. I have Bayard. Uh, he runs the ball with uh, Joe Mixon. And look at this guy. He's a level 8. I don't even think he's a power runner, and he got some decent yards there. All right, so look. Um, so I only have Bayard left. He's loading up the left side here. Uh, I get Peters down last minute. Dunlap again on the rotation. Um, now I got to pick the right guy. Who's he throwing to? And it looks like I'm, I'm tapping in the corner, and he should have thrown to the other corner. His receiver ran back to the line of scrimmage, and that was an incomplete pass. That was a that was an L for the uh, receiver on that play. All right, so here comes the mix and run again. So now I got to move everybody over. I'm trying to drag Bayard over; he's not going. So here comes the mix and run. He's got 10, 20 yards, about twenty five yards. Um, and there's a minute to go. It's fourth down. I'm trying to stop him here. Um. Looks like he's going to throw. 
So I'm dropping uh, <clears throat> dropping to prevent, have Slay Bayard out there. I have two Slays out there now. And for some reason, he makes the catch with Ridley. I have three guys out there with uh, zone uh, defense capabilities, and I couldn't stop anybody there. All right, so I have 20 seconds to score here. Um, I make a mistake here, and don't put anybody down. So now I'm going to run with my uh, generic quarterback, who probably got more yards than Ingram did. Uh, now I just killed, you know, whatever, seven seconds. So this will probably be the last play of the game now. Um, and again, I don't have anybody down. All right, so I have Cook. I got Cook out, but... I have uh, somebody in my face, a white contrail, and he breaks it up, and that's the game. I take the I take the loss here. I lose twenty one fourteen. Um, I ask for a rematch. Uh, let's look at the stats before we do that. All right, so he's three touchdowns to my two, two hundred twenty four yards to my one sixty one. He had eighty four rushing yards, and we both played the same amount of cards. Okay, so I asked for a rematch, and he was more than happy to oblige, which was super cool. Um, I told him that, um, if he wins, um, the second one, then he wins. If I win, then we play, um, best of three. So here's the second game. Um, so I know he's a big Joe Mixon guy, uh, Jamar Chase. I got to, uh, watch him and he has Aaron Donald. So those are the things I got to keep in the back of my head. All right, so I get the ball first. I'm dropping Cook. Um, see, now here's the thing. He's got, um, because he has Donald on his team and because he has um, um, some high-energy guys, he also has, Gen I think it's Janoris, Janoris Jenkins, Adoree Jackson, and Shaq Griffin. And I know I could take advantage of those guys. Uh, the first play, he had Miles Jack on my Cook, but I had such a bad pressure pass that he stopped it. And I think his cook. Uh, I think his um, Miles Jack was level eight too. All right, so there again, um, Ingram. I, he might have gotten ten yards. So I don't know. You, I've I've played against a level eight Ingram before, and he's dominated me. Mine, not so much. I don't know what's his problem. All right, so he's coming at me from the right side. Um, I have cooked down. I think he believes that I'm running the ball here. Um, I hit Cook, and he breaks three tackles and scores a touchdown. So it's 7-0. At least I scored on the first possession. Takes a little bit of pressure off me. Uh, now I'm going to try to work on stopping him. Okay, so right as soon as, as soon as he drops Mixon down, I try to drop I drop Slay. try to drop anybody I know who can tackle. Marcus Peters. Uh, try some Dunlap. Uh, but all he gets by everybody. And I, I again... Why can't my Ingram do that? He's a power runner. He's supposed to, uh, you know, quote-unquote, power through. All right, so anyway, so I know he's got Mixon on the field. I don't know why he didn't keep going with that. But he's got Jamar Chase now. Uh, I think that's uh, Robinson. Um, now, if he runs here, it's a touchdown. But uh, he decides not to, and he throws it to Chase, and I stop him with Peters, which is good because both of my zone uh, defenders – Went with Robinson in the middle of the field. All right, so I got uh, now I got Diggs and Peters on the left, Slay and Bayard on the right. Uh, I have JJ Watt out there, and I sack him. No, I do not. He throws it in the middle of the field, and Peters again knocks it down. I was right on him. I don't know how I didn't get a sack there. Um, all right, so I all I have left is Watt, Slay, and Peters. Um, he's got somebody open on the left. Now I have two Peters on the field. My buy, uh, Slay, I don't know what to do with him now. But then I realized that um, he had one guy open in the middle, so I moved over to him. He threw it to the left, and I knocked it down with Peters, and that was a turnover. There's one second to go, and the theme of this night altogether, with even games that you haven't seen, is I get stuck with one second to go to score, and I always either get sacked or... It, it never works out. Let's put it that way. 
So I, I think I dropped Adams there and it got knocked down. So it didn't even make a difference. Even though I had some blo um some blocking there. I don't know how you block on top of blocking. You knock down my pass while I'm blocking you. Whatever. All right, so I'm still up 7 nothing. It's half. Now, even if I would have kicked a field goal there, at least I know I would have been up. He has a chance to tie me, then stop me, then beat me. Okay, look at Tariq Cohen, wide open. It's the second time he did that to me, and I'm not sure why he didn't do that more often. Because I didn't have anything, anything for that. Gorilla did the same thing to me. Uh, all right, so now he's going to run Mixon. So now I'm going to try to get uh, anybody who, can, who I know can tackle over there to try to stop him. But nobody tackles him anyway. Look at this. He just runs right through everybody. And all right, so I, I got him. That was a little bit better than I thought. But uh, if I was him, I'd just run him again. It's third down now. And he moves him over, and looks like looks like he's running. And there it is. And he gets in there. So he ties up the game, 7-7. Seven seven. I think he had 84 rushing yards in the first game. He has 63 right now. All right, so I have the ball. Um, I have Dalvin Cook available. Um, I'm going to hit him on his out route. Um... He's got really no coverage there. Um, I hit him, and he knocks it down. So that was an L there. Uh, I thought I had that. I probably should have moved him up a little bit. All right, so now I'm going to say, all right, so Ingram can't isn't running for me. Let's run Cook. Let's try uh, Let's try that out. I got Jensen down. I have uh, an offensive lineman that's supposed to give me uh, power. Uh, at, what do you call it? Not speed. Uh, strength. And I got decent chunk of yardage there. But uh, it's 40 seconds to go, third down. I got to uh, stop at the running because obviously uh, I do not have Joe Mixon or Ingram that I can actually, actually do anything. So I'm going to uh, hopefully have Cook out there to catch a pass. But I also put somebody down on the other side. And listen, Devontae Adams is a beast. He caught that over four people. Dalvin Cook was wide open across the field. And I don't know why I didn't throw it to him. But you know what? I'll take it. Adams caught that. I didn't expect him to catch it. He shouldn't have caught that. But he did. All right. So I got Byard and Slay out there. There's two seconds to go. This game is over. I'm in prevent. I just got to click on the right guy. I'm clicking on the middle guy. And he quit his route. I hate when the game does that. And that's the game. I won. I went fourteen seven. Um, it's happened to me before where your guy is supposed to be running a route and he stops. Um, all right, so my two touchdowns is one hundred and fifty yards uh, to one hundred and sixteen. Um, eighty five passing, which was not good. To his fifty two, and he had sixty four yards rushing at sixty five, which was on that last run by Cook. And again, we both played the same amount of cards. All right, so. So now we're both uh, tied in games, one-to-one, -one, and we go to the rubber game of this uh, matchup here to see who, uh, you know, wins. Um, like I said, I lost to, I lost two games to one to Gorilla. Same way. He, he won the first one. I won the second, and then I lost the third. And here, DJ won the first. I won the second, and now we're in the third game. All right, so... Um, if I don't have Cook available, what I try to do is I run Ridley and Robinson uh, off the bat. Uh, I had Stafford available, too. Um, he's got Humphrey on Ridley, so I'm going to try to hit Robinson here. But I threw it. I might have thrown it to Robinson. He hits Ridley. He uh, Humphrey's ability doesn't, doesn't go off. Ridley makes the catch and scores a touchdown. I'll take that, too. I don't know how that happened. There's a lot of... Weird stuff that happens in this game sometimes, and that's one of them right there. Um, I don't know if there was a level advantage. I don't know if uh, Humphrey is fast enough to catch up to Ridley. I have no idea, but Ridley made the catch. All right, so I have... Uh, so he. I don't know if that was Chase. Yeah, he threw, he threw deep to Chase. Um, I had Peters on him, and I think I had Byard on him. Didn't go through. 
Um, he loads up with receivers on the left. He's got Robinson out there, Ridley. Um, I have Slay, Bayard, and Peters. Um, I also have Dunlap and J.J. Watt. And then he throws the ball again deep, and there goes, uh, I guess that was Slay's breakup ability. All right, so now Slay does not have that. So what I'm looking for is somebody to... Uh, because he likes Chase, obviously. So I put Peters on Chase, but now he's got somebody on the other side, which I think is another Chase. Um, and instead of throwing to the new Chase, he throws to the old one, but he makes the catch anyway. This guy. Uh, right now, somewhere Zorro is going nuts right now because he loves Jamar Chase. Not only does he love Jamar Chase, but it, but him scoring on me, it makes, makes Zorro feel warm and uh, fuzzy. All right, so I make a dumb mistake here. I put down Ingram, and I put him too close to the line, so my generic quarterback decides to run the ball, and I got like three yards. All right, so I have now I have Cook down. Um, he's, got some, uh, he's got Aaron Donald coming at me. Um, I dropped Stafford, and I'm hoping that Donald doesn't kill me. So I move out of the pocket. Um, I hit Cook on a short pass, he breaks a couple tackles, gets about 10 yards. Uh, we're looking at third down now, 13 seconds to go. I really need to score here. Okay, automatically I, I block, I, I drop Robinson to block Donald. I have Cook available, and now I have Devontae Adams. Uh, I didn't see who he put on him, but... I threw it to Cook, and he stops him on the one-yard line. Like, I needed that one more yard. Like, why Why can't my guys do that? Like, why can't they stop guys on the one-yard line? All right, so we're 7-7, going at the half. So he's got a shot. I, uh, You know, I got a shot. If the game is up in the air. There's no uh, clear-cut winner at this point. All right, so he's got two guys down, and there's that Tariq Cohen play again. And I tried to tap over on him, and... I got over there with Diggs the last minute, knocked it down. I'm sure that shouldn't have happened. Um, one of my zone guys should have been over there, but whatever. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say no. Uh, all right, so here comes the Joe Mixon run, but you know I can't stop it. Look at this guy. That's what, what t about thirty yards right there. Now again, he should have probably. If he really wanted to win this game, which I know he did, but he should have did that more often. He should have hit me with the Tariq Cohen, the Joe Mixon. You know, he should have just stayed away from Chase. I think he got, you know, he fell in love with the fact that Chase was burning me. But it's still, he, he didn't burn me uh, like Mixon did. All right, so he's thrown, a, he's thrown over into the corner there to Robinson. Diggs knocks it away. It's fourth down now. This is clutch. I have J.J. Watt on the field. I have Slay on the field. Uh, Slay's following Chase around. Um... Now I have uh, Bayard on, on the field. And now I have two Slays on the field. Now I just got to pick the right guy to throw to. I called the Tariq Cohen play right off the bat. I knew he was doing that. So I pushed Slay over there. He knocks it down. All right, so now there's a, uh, a minute 10 left to go. It's 7-7. Seven, seven. That was his mistake. He kind of telegraphed the Cohen thing. He should have uh, He should have threw it somewhere else. All right, so I uh, I run Ingram, and this is the first time the guy actually did anything for me. He ran about 30 yards on that play. All right, so now there's uh, 48 seconds to go. It's only second down, so let's run it in. Now look at this. I move Ingram uh, over. I already have Cook down. Now if he could break this tackle, he's, it's a touchdown. There he is. I swerved him on that. He uh, focused on Ingram, and I dropped... I dropped Cook last minute and snuck him in there. All right, so now I'm up 14-7. He called a timeout. It's 27 seconds to go. Okay, and there's there's a Jamar Chase. I have Peters and Diggs on him, but now I'm going to have to move somebody over because uh, I don't want anybody uh, uh, free. And look at this. He had a guy wide open in the middle of the field, and I intercepted with Xavier Howard. And that's going to end the game. He made a mistake there. He tried to hit... I don't know who that was. It was either Robinson or Chase. Uh, on the outside, he had a guy wide open in the middle because I tried to drag my digs over and he wouldn't He wouldn't drag. And he throws an interception to Xavier Howard. 
Okay, so I have Robinson down. Um, I have Ridley down, and I have Stafford. I'm just going to throw it down the field because I feel like even if he intercepts it, I have a chance to tackle him, and it was an incomplete pass anyway. So I win 14-7. Um, I take the series 2-1. to one. Um, You know, I said this in a previous video. You know, it's not... It's not that the other guy beat you. It's sometimes you make mistakes and beat yourself. He shouldn't have threw, he shouldn't have threw to Car uh, Cohen on that last drive because I saw it coming a mile away. I focused on it as soon as he dropped Cohen. If he would have threw it somewhere else, maybe he would have uh, gotten a touchdown or a completion or whatever. And then on that last play, he had a guy wide open in the middle of the field and he threw it into coverage. And even though it is Xavier Howard, he's a level eight and he caught the interception. Uh, so I so I had one rushing, one passing, uh, 207 total yards to his 108, 145 passing to his 75, 62 yards. I outrushed him, and he had that one turnover at the interception, and he played one more card than me. So there you go. So she knows DJ. Uh, he is a Twitch streamer. Um, she knows DJ 23 on Twitch. Um, he streams. I know he definitely streams Fridays, Friday nights. Um, at 10 o'clock, I believe. Same time the boy streams when he does. Um, but he does stream, um, you know, during the week also. Um, he is an EA Madden player. So if you are interested in, um, watching his stream, uh, check out the, check out the EA Madden Discord. Um, I'm sure you can get that link. I don't know the direct link, but you can get it, uh, in the regular NFL Clash, um, discord or the gorilla jungle discord um the link is in there um but again if you can search him out on um twitch she knows dj 23 just give him a follow and um every time he goes live it'll, you, you should get alert you should get an alert all right so anyway <clears throat> there you go uh two games to one um i told him that i would go on on his stream and talk deck building with him um uh, so we'll figure that out sooner or later but uh, until then, uh, check this guy out on Twitch. Subscribe to my uh, channel. Subscribe to his channel if you can. Uh, give him a follow. Um, like this video, and I'll see you in the next one.